So this is a Dell laptop with the <coughs> processor failure, 7 beep code. Um, I'll try and fix it. So we take the keyboard out, the little tabs across the top, you unplug and just lift it out. And we undo all the screws underneath, crack the case open all the way around the edge. That lifts off. Next we'll remove the hard drive, which just slides out that way, lifts up. There's a screw there to undo the CD drive, that just slides out the way. So we need to get the motherboard out. So we need to remove everything off the motherboard and, and remove it. So we'll take the RAM out, Wi-Fi, battery, heatsink off, fan off, undo all the cables, pop the motherboard out. So unscrew these, whole thing lifts out the way, and then there's the motherboard screws to remove, and it should just pop out. There's a processor there, we'll take that out in a second. Motherboards often have a memory card slot. If you take the memory card out, this is a blank one. It allows you to lift the motherboard out, because otherwise the it's wedged in. Right, so that's um, that's the motherboard out. I'll get it prepared. So we've removed the processor. We've removed any paste or thermal pads on the chips and anything else which may melt or burn. So we're pretty much good to go. So we uh, set the oven to 180 fan, let it preheat. Okay. Fifteen minutes. Right, done. Right, so that's done. Put it back in, see what happens. Okay, all back together. Fixed. That's how you reflow a laptop motherboard.